Stop endlessly searching Netflix and come see what's new this month on Hulu. Stream the entire first season of AMC's Dark. And we're back in it. Welcome back. Playing a bit of Stardew Valley again tonight. Let's let me change something about this real quick. Excuse the tef technical difficulties. How are y'all doing tonight? Just gonna have a chill stream tonight. I know the only reason Blake's hyped about this right now, Mr. Hooligan, is because uh, he gets to see more cranberries. You could say it's, uh, makes this stream pretty crantastic, right? You might notice I uh, changed my uh, arrangement around and my system uh, is all set up. Twenty-five levels deep into the cavern. Okay, we can do that. If we don't get that quest completed this season, we can always do it in the winter. When uh, we don't have any food to worry about any other crops or anything like that. I, might, I am going to have to start harvesting some uh, hay for my uh, animals pretty soon so they don't starve during the winter. I think that's our first batch of grapes. And our beets are done, so we can find something else to put there. I hope my pumpkins don't grow in time for the fair. I'm not sure if they will or not. should I put here now that I don't have any more beets? More cranberries? More eggplants? Probably more eggplants is what I'll end up doing. Sorry, Blake. Yeah, my first batch of grapes. And I didn't even have to water them today. Thank goodness for, my, for this rain. It makes so much wine. I'm gonna be like that drunk ant. Yeah, I suppose I don't make a very good farmer or uh, brewer if I just drink all the alcohol that I make. 
Good job. Alright. Let's go tend to the needs of my animals. Sheep is ready to be sheared too. Just like that. I think we're gonna find something to do. Um, let's see, what does this need? This needs no. That needs refined quartz. That needs iridium bars and batteries. What does this need? That needs refined quartz. I think we might start making more lightning rods so that we can get batteries for when we get enough iridium to start making more iridium sprinklers. Um, I'm gonna need a lot more iron in that case too because I want to make I want to fill up my kegs. We'll see how all that goes. Let's go. Those are all brewing right now, but I'm gonna start brewing grapes eventually, and this honey can be turned into mead. Uh, I think everything else is good, yeah. Oh, I forgot about my apples. And my hay is ready to be harvested. I gotta make sure not to sell that. Oops. Forgot that. Gotta make sure not to sell that because last time... Well, not last time. Last time I thought I, I only needed five. I actually need ten for a bundle. Oh, I'm gonna be really upset if it doesn't accept that because... That's a weird programming flaw if that's the case. Weird approach to gameplay. Sell all our stuff. mineral away, because we crave that mineral. In fact, do I have enough? What do I need for lightning rods? I need batwing, iron bar, and refined quartz. I have seven quartz, enough for one iron bar, and four more. And I have plenty of batwings, I think, yeah. So let's go put this over here. Oh, not in here. The other one. Alright, that's good to hear. I don't have to worry about 
good that it uh, accepts that I don't have to worry about making more wheat again. Um, right, I was gonna put uh, my apples in that other one. Refine, or quartz doesn't take very long to refine either. So I can get started on that as well. Maybe I'll be able to place, uh, place down a couple more lightning rods before this uh, rain goes away. Is that a tree? It is. I thought I had cobblestone there. I guess I do not. And while we're at that, at it, we can just uh, take all this stuff over to town. Um, have the blacksmith crack, o crack open this, these geodes. Turn that uh, prehistoric thing into Gunter. So let's go into town. And talk to the blacksmith. Process geodes. Ooh, more iron. That's always good. Stone. I'll, I'll take it. Lock all the stone paths for me. I think I already have that. Next site. Yeah. Sometimes, you know, you'll get minerals that you haven't turned into the um, museum yet. starting to fill it up. I suppose there is a lot more though. Rather far away from being all the way full. I'm not getting that anytime soon. Alright, let's go turn in that wheat for that bundle. I could probably start getting the things for the other bundles too. I've been really lax with my fishing. But that's okay. I can do that, like, you know, years to come when I don't have to focus on my forest or on my farm so much. Next prismatic shard. Okay. I'll hang on to it. Mm, fodder bundle. Oh, It's not gonna accept it. Shoot. I gotta accept it because it's not in one bundle. Oh well. It's only three o'clock, I can still stop by the uh, general store and pick up some more seeds. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I agree. Why do I have, have to have such high quality wheat? Let's get some more wheat seeds. Probably only five. Just in the same plot that we grew them last time. Oh, right. And what did we say we were gonna get out? Uh, bok choy, four days to mature. I haven't I don't have any bok choy. I could do more pumpkin seeds, I know those are very Those are typically pretty uh pretty good. I want something that keeps producing though. I guess I do bok choy. Uh, so what's that, 40 of them? Yeah, 40 of them. And what's this quest? Smallmouth bass, sure. Again, I, I always accept these and then get caught up in doing other things and totally forget about it. So we're gonna go plant our wheat, plant our bok choy. Um, Try to finish off our lightning rods, so that includes finishing off the refined quartz, getting as much iron as we can, which we should be able to get. No, we can't anymore. No more of that. No more of that. Sell this bixite and fire quartz and sandstone, and we can plant bok choy and wheat. 
Wait. things <laughs> finals and papers and do not yeah yeah I am uh, I'm in the same situation I just got you know a little bit of time free I was actually um, considering a good thing about my major or things related to my major is it's actually almost streamable stuff um, so I was considering like streaming uh, 3d modeling and game development and stuff like that, if I want to do that, um, which I kind of do, um, and maybe someday, or maybe sometime I will, it's just that, um, rather recently, well, yeah, it's, if you pick it up, you're gonna, you're gonna keep, want to keep playing it, that's just the way of, uh, way of this game, it's a very addictive game. Uh, okay, so we're gonna just use that stack so we can get rid of these two, and that, and that, and that. So I've still got refined quartz, iron bar, and batwing. And I'm just gonna put that weed over there. Yeah, I'm, I mean, I'm still learning about it too. Um, but uh, I just got done actually modeling a little train station for a project we're doing in my uh, VR class. Um, but the only reason I started out with streaming uh, Stardew Valley because uh, I just moved my setup re around pretty recently, and I, you know I just got back into streaming, so I'm gonna do some simple stuff first. Uh, but uh, I need to get a capture card so I can start streaming stuff from my Xbox. Um, if I get it before the end of the semester, I'd like to stream my playthrough of Dishonored 2 because I just got that, and it'll be my first time playing through it. Um, I'm just borrowing it until the end of the semester. That is. Um, but I also, rather recently, uh, got a Raspberry Pi. <coughs> Excuse me, a Raspberry Pi that I'm, I'm playing around with, um, and uh, which is a small microcomputer. Um, and there's this uh, platform on it called Emulation Station or RetroPie, in which you you know it's it's basically a, like a, a emulator for old school games and stuff like that. So I'm gonna I'm gonna stream some of those once I get uh, a capture card because um, I want to go back to like all the games that got me into gaming in the first place so that's like a bunch of uh, uh, Game Boy Advance games and stuff like that okay, I'm trying to think of how I want to set these up can I set it up here? I cannot Is one of the most powerful tools our species has created. there we go, that's fine but yeah, I'm, I'm really excited because I got all the ROMs, like I got like a couple of the games that really got me into gaming was uh, when we first got, when my family, you know, my two brothers and I got first got our first Game Boy Advance SP. Yeah, we could get some Pokemon because I have never actually played through a Pokemon the entire way through, it being the younger, the youngest brother. There's a lot of, uh, there's a lot of, uh, um, mute that. Uh, but there's a lot of, uh... <laughs> uh... Okay, in my defense, there are plenty of games, because I'm the youngest of three kid or three boys, there are plenty of games that I've played, quote-unquote, um, just by vicariously watching my brothers. Um, because, you know, I, I rarely ever got the Game Boy in my hands, and uh, the Pokemon games are actually pretty long to complete, at least they were for me, because I'm not very good at them. Uh, so I, I wanna, I wanna, uh, go through and, uh, play them eventually, and maybe I'll do that on a stream, because I got, I got, you know, all the original Game, game Boy titles, some of the, you know, Game Boy Advance titles, Game Boy Color game titles, and stuff like that. Um, but also the ones that I was gonna start off with is the, a bunch of the Game Boy Advance, t uh, titles uh, that, like I said, got me into gaming. 
Uh, so that's Metroid Zero Mission is what the three that come to mind for me the most or initially are Metroid Zero Mission, uh, Super Mar- Mario Brothers, and or Super Mario World, whichever port it was for the whatever it was the port was called for um, the Game Boy Advance, and then uh, Lord of the Rings: The Two Towers, which I think I still think is a good game. Um, and then also to that extent, there's uh, the, the Third Age, which is a strategy game. I think a pretty underrated strategy game, like a, a turn-based strategy game that was on the on the Game Boy Advance. And those were all a lot of all a lot of fun. And I am glad to see that quartz is being produced so fast. See if that. Yeah. Sorry, you'll hear. Uh, you'll hear the uh, music cut in and out. That's just because I'm trying to mute it every time an ad comes up. Sorry, <laughs> sorry, Spotify. <laughs> but I'm not paying for uh, a subscription or anything. What do I have cloth for? Is that one of the bundles? Quality crops. Right, I just need pumpkins. Um, chef's bundle, I should probably start cooking, huh? I don't have a truffle or a monkey roll. Yeah, um, I actually, because I needed to try it out, I just got through uh, playing through it just on my own, not streaming or anything. Um, and the, it, it handles really well for you know being a, being an emulation, being a port, um, which is fine. Uh, and I'm really excited to go back and play you know as much as I can. Oh, I have oak resin. I could do that one. Um, but I'm really excited to go back and like uh, 100% it again because I, I think I remember like a lot of I played that game so much I, I remember a lot of uh, um, a lot of the like hidden areas and like uh, secret power ups and stuff like that secret upgrades so it'll be fun to go back and do that and then I, I also have Metroid Fusion which wasn't as good and not as memorable for me um, for me personally the, as Zero Mission was. That'll be cool. Right. So maybe lucky today. Cool. But I need to. I need to get a capture card before I even consider doing any of that. So, I mean, I could get the emulator installed on my computer, but since I already have everything set up on my Pi, I'd rather not do twice the work. You know. Hello, cranberries. Turn my phone on silent so that the vibration isn't picked up so much so harshly on the microphone. I guess since I have so many fruits and berries going on, my primary uh, farm technique will be brewing and preserves. So I already have a, a, a shed set up that's basically just going to be my keg shed. I can make another shed that's basically just my preserve shed, and that's okay.
Yeah, yeah, but I, I mean, and I, I'll do that eventually, um, because I think I'm gonna run out of, uh, brewing material before I run out of, uh, uh, preserves material, just because it's the higher density. But right now, I'm just turning all the preserves into jam, because, I mean, you've seen my, you've seen my shed. I have, uh, I have, like, apples and oranges and, uh, grapes in there that I still need to brew. And those I, I got basically exclusively for brewing. You can turn uh, basically any fruit into wine. And a lot of the vegetables you can actually brew too. Yep. All that cranberry jelly. Delicious. Our mission cranberry jelly. Alright, let's get some cranberries out, even though I don't really need to because I already have plenty in my inventory. And what else needs to go up? Just the cranberries. Cranberries. Oh! Oh, look at you! You did end up playing. get to you. We'll have to play together whenever uh, the multiplayer comes out. <laughs> you don't know what I- yeah, yeah, sure. Oh, I took too many cranberries with me. Don't let me be a bad example for you. Finals and papers and all that, right? I suppose I could try to start making more preservation jars. What do I need? Preserves jars is a lot of wood, a lot of stone, and a lot of and a coal. Which I can buy all that stuff. Like I said, I'm making enough money at this point. I will check my mushrooms and then go into my brewing area. Aw. Oh. That's okay. I mean, whenever it does come, we can. We can play. I can handle the brewing and you can handle the fishing or whatever. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go to Robin today. Get a bunch of a uh, bunch of stone, a bunch of wood. start making some more uh, preserves jars and uh, brewing stands. Do you know if there's like a... Uh, I'm, I'm sure it doesn't matter, but just in case it does, is there a, like a better way to place these that will produce batteries or get struck by lightning on a more consistent basis? Special day, you can sense it. Yeah, cause I'm, gonna, I'm gonna smooch you. How can I not smooch you while you're carving? Okay, fair enough. Alright, let's go get that wooden stone. And then we'll head over to uh, the blacksmith and get some coal. To really get a horse. A horse, a horse, a horse, of course. Let's get some. Yeah. That's okay. I will just have to deal. with uh, whatever chance I have at getting batteries. Because like I said, I'd like to upgrade to Iridium ASAP.
groovy chair. Gross. But I got Kia. Too overpriced. Oh, well, that's okay. I'll just spend winter, uh... And I have, like, two or three batteries already, but I'll just spend winter mining. Maybe then I'll actually get a, enough iridium to make a difference whenever I do uh, happen to get the batteries. Like I said, we need a lot more coal, too. Actually, hold on. Uh, copper bar, iron bar, I guess oak resin will be the limiting factor here, and coal. Let's get 150 coal. And then, a bunch of iron ore. A bunch of copper ore. Which I could, should be mining myself, but again, I have the money to spend. Let's go back to bus stop and go. Let's see, to finish off the kegs, I need nine, uh, 14 more kegs in here. And to finish off the preserves, I just need five. But I will eventually move the preserves into another shed. That way I can get more of them. So let's craft one, two, three, four, five. Mega WBW. It's going pretty good. Just having a having a little chill stream tonight. Let's see what do we need for our kegs? We need copper bar, iron bar, oak resin. You had to stop playing. Have you looked up into Factoria? That might be up your alley. I have not. Um it's probably not that big anymore, but uh, there was this game I wanted to try from a while back. Um, God, I can't remember what it's called right now. Oh, I come on. Screeps. Screeps, that's what it's called. Um, and it's gonna sound super nerdy, but I love it. Uh, uh, it's this game where uh, you... It's, a, it's like an RTS kind of thing. But the way you get your, um, that's not what I want to do. The way you get your, uh, character, or your, uh, yeah, your units to do things is by, um, writing JavaScript code. So you code your program, or you code your, uh, guys into doing them. Or your, uh, little units into walking around and, uh, doing what you want them to do, like mining and stuff like that and attacking. Um, and gathering resources. But what's Factorio? It's not, I mean, is it is it similar to Stardew Valley where it's... You're already out? Oh, because the JavaScript. <laughs> <laughs> or maybe it's just because the RTS. Not, not, a, not everyone is a fan of RTSs, which, you know, each their own. 
I actually haven't played an RTS in a while. Um, but I used to be really into them. Like what, back when, uh, back when I first started playing on the computer, I started playing with uh, Age of Mythology and Age of Empires and stuff like that. Got some batteries. And the only thing better than getting a tool you can depend on 100%. Okay, now we're up to 12 batteries. That's good. Again, only one Iridium bar, though. So. Move. 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 I don't really need that much stone right now. I probably had had enough in here anyway. Yeah, I had 235. Oh well. <laughs> I mean. That's that's fair. I'm a I'm a computer science major. I, I like the uh, I like the coding. Um. So you know. <laughs> I just think it's a very uh, very neat concept. You have to build a spaceship, but to do so, you have to build an automated factory to accomplish it. I do like the, uh, <laughs> um, I do know that's the, uh, or, uh, I do like the idea of spaceship stuff. Uh, I am a sucker for any sort of spaceship game. I love, uh, FTL, um, Kerbal Space Program. I'll probably play that on here eventually. Um, so look forward to a lot of crashes in that. Um. But yeah, I'll look into Factorio. Is it is it pretty cheap? I mean, if it if it's you know if it's not, I'll just get it whenever it, if it's if it, if it ever goes on sale or something. Okay. I should keep the list. If you guys. Back to me. Be right back. You're right, I am. Sorry about that. <laughs> what I was saying is that yes, we always pl you always play it when we hang out, but um, if I were to stream it, I wouldn't be drunk, uh, and I could be a little more cohesive when we do so. You know, no offense to you know your style of play, but I do have about 200 more hours. Um, thanks for thanks for letting me know I'm muted, by the way. But I do have about 200 more hours in the game. So we might be able to actually, you know, get to orbit or do think other cool things. Um, but yeah, in fact, I'll, I'll look into Factorio. Um, what I was gonna say is I got a notepad um, so that uh, I'm gonna take down suggestions of things that you guys want me to play um, on stream and stuff like that. So if you want to leave some in the in the chat or whatever, I will take it down. Factorio, you mentioned the Pokemon and the. Uh, uh, other emulation games, which I'm gonna do, like I said, once I uh, once I get a capture card. Um, but anything else you want to leave in the in the chat, I will do. I mean, I'd love to I'd love to 
stream like uh, Overwatch or Smite or stuff like that. <laughs> You're right, it is so much more fun. Um, I wish I could show you the cool thing that I'm doing right now. I, I, uh, I'm trying to build a stock uh, rotor, a stock propeller, so you can like make a uh, make a helicopter and stuff like that. And people have done it. And there's plenty of guides to do it. Uh, I'm still just getting getting my sea legs or you know air legs in that cut in that in that regard. Yeah, Overwatch. Um, see, I'm still rocking like a Radeon R270, like uh, as far as a graphics card go. So it can it can run Overwatch fine. It's not great. Sometimes it has a little FPS stutter and stuff like that. Um, but I'm just concerned about how it will be it, uh, or how it will do streaming at the same time. So I might have to test some things out. I might just resort to playing Smite and stuff like that, which might be almost as graphically intensive. I'm not sure. I'll just crack, crank the graphics way down. So, Factorio, Pokemon, and Metroid Fusion, Overwatch. <laughs> yeah. We can we can show the world how bad we are in that game. What was I gonna do in here? I was gonna make a bunch of kegs. I'm always down for kegs. As many kegs as I can make. Which looks like nine. Then we can start brewing some more. Now we're only four short of what we need to fill this place up. I knew from very early on in uh, this playthrough that I wanted to do, uh, I wanted to brew, brew things. So like, I tapped as many oak trees as I could get, as I could find, so that I'd have, uh, so I, that I'd have enough resin to, uh, to make all this. <laughs> I'm gonna do grits. I'm gonna have a very diverse set of alcohol coming out of these uh, these kegs. Oh no, I'm just gonna put them back and not, not keep them. Mead and apple cider and grape wine. All the good stuff. Uh, I guess I'm just gonna make the last of these. While I have them. I'm gonna put everything else back. Tomorrow I'll start clearing a place for another shed. Hey wifey, how are you? So fine. Uh, yep. Um. Oh yeah, that sucks. Are you still working at the zoo? I didn't know if that was like just a volunteer thing you did that one summer, or if uh, you were still working there. No, you got bored of it, so I stopped last time. Sp 
Sprouts. I don't know what that is, or I can take a guess because it sounds familiar. Is it like a is it a preschool place or a uh, daycare place? <laughs> if it's not, I'm gonna feel really stupid for suggesting it, but it sounds like it. <laughs> Yeah, I need, to, I need to find a job for this summer, too. But I am a little focused on school right now. Hey, we got our pumpkins! Hopefully we get five uh, top-quality pumpkins out of that. And we could just go and take that to our... Uh... Oh, it's like a Whole Foods, okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Do you sell sprouts? Probably sell some Brussels sprouts, I'm sure. Um, yeah, uh, hopefully we can take those pumpkins to uh, to turn in at the uh, town hall. Hopefully we get five top quality pumpkins out of them, and then we'll have to find something else to put here. I guess I probably, I don't know, I could do, um, sunflowers. They're not entirely renewable. Hmm. Yeah, something would be terribly wrong if you specifically in the dairy, dairy department were selling Brussels sprouts. Get your Brussels sprout milk here. Get your sprout milk. Top, top quality, top shelf sprout milk right here. That sounds disgusting. Come on. Okay. Probably better than whatever I'm getting from these cows, though, to be fair. On the subject of polymorphing animals. Because we, we were just we were talking about that last time I streamed. Does do you think the polymorphed cow is producing human milk or uh, or 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 uh, cow milk? And um. <laughs> Does that affect your decision to try it or not? <laughs> to drink some uh, drinks of its of its milk? Yeah, I think it would be cow milk too. I hope it'd be cow milk. Wow, I got ten. That's cool. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Bio or uh, mentally, it is a human, so he has to deal with that for the rest of it. Or uh, I guess she, in this case, she would have to deal with that for uh, for the rest of her life. Even though you can breed all the cows, but they're all female, so they all because they all produce milk. I don't know. I'm not trying to question the logistics of it. Turned my gain down. The 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 rooms here in Iva aren't exactly soundproof. That's okay though. Come on. Gonna make it a lot of money today.
that back, and that back, and that's everything. <laughs> I will. There's a whole sex education course about that. <laughs> Thank you for that. Alright, I need to put five of these away and one wine. And then I can sell everything else. Pumpkin, pumpkin. I was gonna say there's a uh, there's a fair coming up, but I'm not actually not too worried about winning the fair. I already got the rare crow from last year, so I don't really need to get first place or anything. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna sell everything. Too bad we're not on comms or anything. I would love to hear you enunciate that. <laughs> circle, circle, black dot. Alright, I'm gonna... I guess I'm gonna make another shed back here. Where should I make a shed? I can make one right here, but I need this goat to move. It's already 1250, so if I want to make anything, I should do it fast. I'm going to make another shed so that I have room for my preserves. Because I'm going to have a preserve shed and a, uh... And now, insurance-minded speeches... A, uh... Let's talk about power. To illustrate this, allow me brewing to shed, if nothing else. Switch over to all crops and be a true American farmer. Man, do you not know, know how prominent the uh, the dairy industry is in in uh, the dairy and beef industry is in America and the chicken industry? Come on. Saying that ranchers aren't true American agriculturalists, please. All right, construct farm buildings. What do I need for a shed? That's a deluxe coop. I should get a stable, but I don't have a hundred hardwood yet. Uh, shed. I need three hundred wood. Let me see if I can. I can purchase that. Uh, I have one hundred and thirty-eight, so one hundred and sixty-five is what I need. That's true. They are true American. It doesn't actually say that this this game takes place in America. I mean, it's very American in its ideals and the fact that, you know, I leave the factory to go live in the countryside or whatever. Um, but maybe this is a maybe this is a world that doesn't have an America or maybe this is a country that doesn't uh doesn't have share the same those same American ideals. All right, let's Move you right there. And then I need to get a stable eventually, so I should start farming that, uh... Fine, be a Canadian, you damn commie. <laughs> You're comparing me to Tyson? How could you? <laughs> and when I think commie, I rarely think... Canada. <laughs> yeah, okay, and I will get some more of my silver steam. That's true. That's true. You're not wrong. And how how far how far off is that maple leaf from being a uh, a uh, red star? Coincidence? I think not. All right. Let's get some more of those. 
Bells. Oh, just barely not enough. The hammer and sickle, sickle of the future? Is that really what they say about maple leaves? I must be, uh, I must be out of the loop. That's pro- but that's just- that's just propaganda rhetoric, that's just, you know, uh... Hate speech produced by the other trees. Because they got jealous of how popular the maples were. Come on, this is basic elementary stuff. Yeah? Communist basis? I mean, the climate's not that different from the the homeland, the Mother Russia, so it's understandable. We also I, I got into the situation again where I don't remember if I actually watered these crops or not, so they get extra water today. I'm just trying to get as many grids as possible. <laughs> A true-blooded capitalist. Enjoy your capitalism. I'll enjoy my grapes and my and my wines and my cranberries. And I'll enjoy going to sleep at five o'clock in the evening. Your morning? Why why are you talking about morning? It's five o'clock in the evening. Hey, I got the millionaire achievement. I think that means I got Yep. A million gold. You guys couldn't see that, but it did pop up on my screen. <laughs> Subsidized corn. That's fine. You can do that. I'm not stopping you. I'm not that passionate of a communist, I guess. Right, there's gonna be a fair today, isn't there? What am I gonna use for my Grange display? I don't know. Whatever I can get my hands on. I bet I don't have one more pumpkin. Six pumpkins is the way to go, apparently. That's okay. I'll get some wine or something to put in there. Take some of the cranberries, maybe. Oh, I do have more pumpkins. Sweet! Those grew right on time. I guess I do, like I said, I guess I do sunflowers here. Because they, they take a very short amount of time to grow. Eight days, I think. Well, it's not super long. Whichever one takes four days, I think I'm going to do that. Actually, I think cheese is pretty good. I'll do, I'll do cheese. I know that you're supposed to, for the fair, you're supposed to have a pretty even blend of, like, animal products. 
and uh, agriculture or er, and uh, plant products. So I will get some cheese, I guess. resin I can make a couple more kegs too. Hey, there's some cheese. Cloth, quartz. Gotta make sure not to get rid of all that cheese. What am I going to put in my Grange display? Definitely six pumpkins. That's the way to go. Um, probably this wine. This mead. And I actually don't know if I get them back at the end of the, the fair. So I'm gonna keep these six pumpkins separate from the other five that I grew for uh, for that uh, bundle. So six pumpkins. Artesian goods, animal product, one so one cheese, and a fruit of any kind, I think is the way it works. Let's get one cranberry. You lose them, I think. Okay, good. Good thing you told me that before I, uh, before tomorrow, I'll tell you what. Oh, these aren't done yet. I thought they were done. Alright, so, uh, six pumpkins, uh, some mead, because I need that wine for the, for the other bundle, uh, a fruit, so artesian products, fruit, and animal product, cheese. Okay. Yes. So, we have... Six pumpkins, that's nine. Yep, that's enough for my Grange display. And we can put everything else. Pumpkin, pumpkin, eggplant, all my eggplant, all my corn. I need my oak resin, my mayo, my cloth, my cheese, my wine. All that can get sold for boo-boo bucks. And while I'm at it, I will get Oh, I don't have the wood. Right. Never mind that. I was gonna say I'll I'll make some more kegs while I'm at it, but I do not have the wood for it. In fact, while we're at it, let's just go take those pumpkins over to get the quality crops bundle right now, because I'm gonna go buy some more things from the general store. But I, I don't know what the reward is for completing that bundle. It might be some seeds that I can plant anyway. So let's go check that first. Because that's the last uh, last crop for the crops bundle I need. Or for the, for the whole unlock in the pantry, I believe. So in the pantry, Colonel Mustard did it with the revolver. So, quality cross bundle. Oh, I get the greenhouse! Yes! I didn't even know that. That's sweet. Oh, and I got a preserve jar from it too. Everything's coming up me.
Hey! I just saw that snowy day. I'm sorry I missed that earlier. It's following me on Twitch. Thank you that. Thank you for that. I uh, I know all these people, which I appreciate that uh, my friends are following me, but I won't say your name on stream just because I archive these and all that. Oops. <laughs> I just saw your comment, uh, Mega. So thank you for thank you for that. Uh, so Snowy, if you're uh, if you're following and uh, all that, just want to say hi. And same to Mr. Cool again, Mega. And I don't know if Belmo's still following, but Belmo is here. I guess I can load up on crops now because. Because I'm still gonna have the greenhouse during the during the uh, during the winter. So yeah, uh, just thanks for uh, thanks for following along, all the all my viewers out there. Oh, oh my! Like I said, I wanna I wanna do this a little more uh, consistently, and maybe play some games that you guys want me to play. So if you have a if you have a suggestion, I got a list. Just throw it out there in chat. Put trees in the greenhouse, by the way. That's good to know. Do If I put trees in the greenhouse... Oh, they will make fruit all seasons? I guess I'm gonna go buy some uh, buy some trees then. Um, I was just about to ask that. Because I have, I have uh, three rows of trees um, outside uh, that produce... I mean, each row produces fruit for each season. Okay. So, what do we have? We have uh, apple sapling, pomegranate. I think I'm gonna go pomegranate. Let's see, one, two, three, and one, two, three. Yeah. Then I need to go plant all that stuff. Oh right, I need to get um, 40 of whatever as well. Um, artichoke? No, that takes four. Amarath takes seven, 12, eight days, four days, 10 days. I already have some bok choy. I guess I will get, how, much, how many more days do I have in this season? I have 13. Lowe's, we know that pros depend on their tools to do more than just cut. So I will get tools help pros meet deadlines, keep promises, and protect no, reputation. Now it's through too May long. 1st during DeWalt days at Lowe's, pro customers can get up to 30% off select DeWalt power tools. And the only thing better I guess I'm gonna get some Amaranth seeds. Is getting that tool for up to 30% off. Visit the pro desk or lowesforpros.com. Don't remember how you do it. Well, this is again, this is the first time that I have um I have the uh went to the store. Oh, well, you see um this is the first time that I have the greenhouse unlocked. I oh, dang it. Uh actually, you know what? Sure, why not? Let's get some amaranth seeds. We need 40 of them. So, as far as, you know, the actual layout of it all, your guess is probably better than mine, but that's okay. And I have, I have some extra sprinklers, I believe, so that I can put them in the greenhouse. But for the time being, since I already have the, and if I don't, I mean, I'll just put whatever sprinklers I have in there for winter, because I don't need them for the crops outside. Um, so yeah, if not, I'll just, you know, get started on the trees, because they don't need sprinklers or anything. It's cranberry seeds, I want the amaranth seeds. So amaranth, boop, 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 boop. Got another preserves jar, so let's go take care of that. Yeah. Unmute this now that the com uh, commercials are over. And... What 
did I have to put in here? Nothing. Oh, yeah, the honey. Honey, honey, honey. Got my jelly. Um... I guess I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna um, fill these up again, and they will finish. When they finish, I'm gonna move them to the other uh, shed, and that'll be my preserve shed. And I think the shed will be done by the time these are finished up. Mr. Hooligan, again. I'm just gonna put the preserves in here while I wait, and let's go get that. Um, let's just sell everything, go to sleep, and then we'll have. I still want to take the cranberries with me. I will sell everything, go to sleep, and then tomorrow will be the uh, the fair, the county fair. Where we'll put up all our grand stuff, or our, our, all our stuff on display. And then, before we do that, we can go ahead and uh, get into the greenhouse. Let's put this in here, and... You know what, I'm gonna put... That's not what I want. Put these in here so I don't accidentally sell them. Cranberry jelly, wild plum, I'm sure what not. Some mayonnaise, and two pickle cheese. Alright. No point in going to bother anyone else right now. Let's just go to sleep. One thing I like about this game is you don't actually have to complete like a full day. You can just go back to sleep if you want. Hey, we're getting a greenhouse. Unfortunately, that's probably going to distract me from uh, the work I need to do out in uh, Desert Bluffs to get Iridium. Or uh, Cactus Flats. I said Desert Bluffs. Whatever it's called gonna distract me from mining. That's the point. Beautiful and sunny tomorrow. And we're gonna be lucky today. Cool. Oops. Yes. Do I have the wheat? I do. <laughs> no! No! Do you see this? <laughs> I have the worst luck with this freaking wheat. I need five regular, or uh, ten regular wheat, and it keeps giving me the uh, extra stuff. I guess I just keep, I guess I just hold on to it. Wheat takes five days to grow. I'll make some more wheat today, I guess. Actually, I can't even go to the store today. Dang it. Can't go to the store because it's uh, the day of the fair. I mean, it's a good thing that I'm getting good quality wheat and good quality products, but just buy like a hundred wheat, yeah. Well, the thing is, I actually bought like a whole row or like 
maybe uh, one or two sprinklers worth to begin with, but I thought I only needed five. I only needed five uh, wheat. I, di I didn't think I needed ten. And the bundle it's for is just for the uh, friendship bundle anyway, so it's not like it's pivotal. Um, <laughs> but it's just really frustrating that I've gotten this far and it keeps giving me uh, the wrong stuff. Stuff I don't need. Plus then I'd have to water a hundred weed, and nobody wants to do that. We have the greenhouse now. I'm gonna go plant. Can I? Oh, I can get these. Dang. Get all the stuff. I guess I just put wheat here. Yeah, that's gonna be my course of action because I already have these sprinklers ready. So I'm gonna need 48 wheat. I wish I could go to the uh, general store today. without uh, milking my cows. They'd probably appreciate it. Did I miss my apples? I did not. Let's go ahead and put our apples in here. All our apples in one basket. <laughs> for this. Actually, preserves jars are really easy to make, so it doesn't really matter. Okay. Okay. Uh, we're gonna keep the wheat around just because I don't want any more mishaps. Cranberries. Ah, oh, I need the grapes for the wine. Right, that's what I meant to put in there. Bok choy, corn, luckily I only put one stack. Uh, wheat's here. Let's put... And then I will go to... Oops. Um, this there. And then I'll go to the fair after this. Be sure to pick up everything from the... From the chest on the way. So grapes. And I'll put the corn. The fair goes until like five, I think. I mean, it doesn't matter. Regardless, it'll be by the time it's over. Okay, so cheese, fruit, mead, pumpkin. By the time it's over, I'll um, everything will be closed, so I won't be able to go to the general store general store. Okay, what can I shop? Oh, no. Um, pumpkin, 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 pumpkin. Cheese, meat, cranberries. Hey, how you doing, girl? I have a wife. Uh... 
bet on green, right? Green has a better chance of winning. Oh, I don't have my star tokens yet. Can I buy my star tokens? I don't know where I buy my star tokens. Read my fortune. Ah oh, yes, it's Robin's birthday. She thought everyone forgot, but then you show up with a nice gift. What a good friend. Ooh, it's dark. And I see you in a thin young lady. She looks quite hopeful and eager to spend time with you. Hmm. What's this young lady's name? I believe it starts with an L. It better start with an L. That's Leah. She has my wife. Um, yes. Uh, not recently, but yes. I've been to the beach. Alright, I can't go through there. You know what? I don't really even care. I already have. I already have the uh, uh, rare crow from this season, so I'm just gonna say. Uh, yes, I'm ready for my display to be judged. Second place, okay. Oh, right, that's how I get my, uh... So I just pick everything up? Yes, okay, so I can get everything back. Awesome. So I do get everything back, and I will talk to you. Bet green. 500. Okay. Because that's the trick, actually, that uh, green has a higher percentage of chance of winning than uh, blue. Or than orange blue. Uh, star drop, dried sunflowers, fedora. I don't want any of this. In fact, well, actually, the fact that I have it means I should probably get some stuff. Get a rare crow. I already have a rare crow. Actually, I would. Mm, can I buy that? Yeah, but like, uh, Fedora, it's so gross. Oops. Cancel. Make sure I select a green. 500. I'll get the rare crow. Because I'm pretty sure I have it. I'm fairly certain I already have it, but I want to be sure. So. Go get that rare crow and then go back home. Yes. Go get that rare crow. I don't need to start right. Let's just put up the rare crow. You 
just gonna chill for a bit. And now that I'm done with all of this, videos. And I'll probably just go to sleep now. I'll put up some flowers for my wife. She's already asleep. Oh, 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 O'Reilly! Right now at all. Yes, go to sleep for the night. I hope you're happy. I got the fedora even though I didn't really want it. <laughs> Ugh. Ready for this? This is going to be super satisfying. Gonna love all this, you audio listeners. Oh yeah. Make some ASMR out of that. <laughs> Alright, so today's agenda is get wheat. Uh, plant in our greenhouse. And I'm not sure what else. Sorry for that uh, little break. It's answering the question. Uh, let's go with that. Right, so. Wheat. Uh, set up a greenhouse. Actually, milk my cows today. Set up my shed. My preserve shed, if it's ready. I don't know if Robbie, Robin's finished with it yet or not. Hello? I think I, I think I know that fifth viewer. How you doing? I'm just having a uh, having a chill little stream here tonight. Playing a bit of Stardew Valley. You hanging out with everyone else? I don't know how that's going down. Hope you guys are having fun. Tell everyone I said hi. To everyone else in chat, this probably sounds super cryptic. <laughs> but it's not. Trust me. Give me that milk. I love it when I take that milk. milk.
That's fine. It's, that's perfectly fine. It's twitch.tv slash mcnicknock. Um, if you want to get it on your browser, I know when I sent that over the snap, it, uh, it kind of just did its whole Snapchat thing, where it, uh, it recognized it as a URL, so I tried to... So you couldn't get the actual text of it, it was just the, the link. Alright, 9.30, and it's a Wednesday. Oh, it's it's a Wednesday. I can't go to the uh, can't go to the store today. I. These preserves are done. I will move them over into that shed, like I said. Um, but until then, I'll just make do with what I have in here. I guess I didn't go pick up my eggs today. That's fine. Again, I'm not too concerned. This is all just pretty menial stuff, right? I can't can't make mayonnaise out of milk. I need egg for that. Uh, but yeah, this is all just pretty menial stuff to keep my uh, keep my income up. I'm gonna take my all this stuff. And I guess I need to go make another chest too. Well, good thing I didn't need to go to the uh, store. Or good thing I can't go to the store today anyway. I don't think I have enough time for all of that. Skip that and get some more wood. having a chill night. No, I am. This is, uh, this is the start to a busy week for me. Got more than a couple projects due this week. 69. <laughs> uh, but I do have 69. Hey, Hobo Sprinkles! You right, you right, that's me. Hey, Belmo, how's it going? Um, yeah. That's me. That's my name. Don't wear it out. Garrett Stoutfoot. Maybe I should, uh, maybe I should change all my, uh, my, my name on all my social media accounts to that. Though I made, I made McNicknock so iconic. For those not in the loop, Garrett Stoutfoot was the name that of my character in my, uh, one of the D&D campaigns I, I played pretty recently. I was a, uh, I was a halfling, uh, um, rogue. I stole everything. <laughs> or I tried to steal everything. <laughs> Yeah, keep the current name. Your brother will. Oh, cool! He can. Uh, he can. He's gonna say I'm fat, and he's gonna laugh at how bad I'm doing. But I think I'm doing pretty good. He's taking a long time. What work trip did he go to the, to get drunk on today? I don't even know. Just following along in the conversation. In the group chat. Hobo Sprinklers, I will say though, Hobo Sprinkles does make a good, make for a good both username and uh, if you want to make a, like a, a crazy old wizard in D&D, that's a, that's a pretty good, pretty good start right there. Hobo Sprinkles. That would be, that would be a good D&D character name, so keep that in mind. He went to a brewery and he was here. He just left for a bit. Oh! Went to a Oh, I guess, yeah. I was thinking brewery, but yeah. And that makes sense. Yeah. Oh yeah, he's doing laundry, isn't he? Sorry about that. The reason is our, 
I think our dryer at home. If I if I remember what my uh, my brother or what my mom said earlier this week is that our heating element in our dryer just went out. So that's why you're stuck with him. Yeah. Oh yeah, you guys are playing Curse of Strahd. That's just like a, a, a middle middle ground kind of thing. I never actually finished Curse of Strahd. My uh, my party kind of broke apart before uh, before we could. Played maybe one or two sessions in Curse of Strahd. I think we got to like the first big mini boss. Um, and that was it. I hope you're enjoying Curse of Strahd. It seems like a cool little little campaign. Cranberries, peach sapling. Yeah, my name is the same on Steam. Yeah. Uh, actually, no. That might not be true. Uh, let me look through. I think I changed it on Steam. Yeah, it's, uh, Bearded Peter Pan. Uh, there's actually a link to it in my I'm Being Social section on Twitch. But if you're, like, on mobile or something like that, it's Bearded Peter Pan, capital B, capital P, capital P, no spaces. Explain to Dylan, actually, he's there, he can he can understand, that I would be playing something else if he would have gotten back to me about that capture card question that I asked him earlier today, which he uh, he still hasn't responded. Because I would like uh, I would like to know if he still has that capture card, because I would buy it off of him. But uh, he didn't say anything, and I would be playing something totally different right now. If. If he had responded to my text message. Oh shit. Swear to god. <laughs> Is he complaining? Tell him he's gay. I did that one wrong, too. That's okay. I don't care. There's the proper way to place that. Okay, so I can't do it here. Can't do it in these eight. So I can do it. Start right there. Oops. Hold on. I'll punch a hole through your chest, call it a window maker. <laughs> Be whistling through your chest bounds. Also, a friend has it. Oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, then, uh, then let me know the deets. If it's just like an Elgato or something like that, or if it's something cheaper, or if you know any anything cheaper, because I'd like to I'd like to get one so I can start. Uh, streaming Xbox and uh, some Raspberry Pi games or some uh, emulation games. If you're still listening, you yeah, know, whatever. <laughs> can you knock uh, Stardew Valley, but it's actually a lot of fun. So, screw you, Dylan. Put 
things Do not fret, for I am here now. Hey, Welcome, a Molly Pop. Which is also a great name. You guys are really good with these usernames. I was I was very I was very much fretting before. You could you could tell, right? I thought something something is amiss. I am a missing a miss, if you will. Hey hey. <laughs> I'm glad you are enjoying this. Are you guys having fun? I know you guys uh, don't get to play D&D &D tonight, but you are uh, getting turned. So, this chat should turn pretty freaking awesome pretty soon. You guys continue to get turned. Just so you know, I'm I'm gonna continue to pronounce your username like that with the long A. Is it okay if I call you A Lamau Lollipop? Because I think that's that's also very important. <laughs> yeah, I almost envy you, but I I have to get up for a nine o'clock class tomorrow, so. Crap, I don't even have enough sprinklers. What an idiot. <laughs> Oops. I can alleviate that. Um, I was mentioning t earlier, but you guys weren't watching the stream. Um, but if you guys are going to continue to watch and you have games that you would like to see me play, let me know. Um, I have a list here of games to try out. I have like uh, Factorio, Pokemon, Metroid Fusion, Overwatch. So yell at me in the chat. And I will do my best to, uh, to get those and play whatever, you know. Or I'll just play whatever I want. Whatever. Metroid, yeah! Yeah, uh, I, uh, I told this story a little earlier, but some of the people watching might not have been here for it. I, uh, recently got a, a Raspberry Pi, which is this little, uh, microcomputer. And one of the projects that I see a lot of people do with it, and I did it recently, is, uh, turn it into a RetroPie gaming device. Which is like an old, which is like an emulation station. Like an, em like, an emulator for old games. Um. So... You, uh, so I can go back and play a bunch of the, uh, the, uh, old Game Boy games and Game Boy Advance games and stuff like that, and NES games and titles that I really used to love, um, which I still do, um, Daddy? and stream them, so that's what I'm gonna do. Uh, well, uh... And, uh, once I get a capture card, I'll start, uh, streaming some of that and some more Xbox titles, but for now it's just gonna be, uh, PC Steam titles. player came to the produce stand the other day. Tell Dylan I appreciated that video because I watched it too. Cold open.
satisfaction guarantee and see why we've been ranked highest in customer satisfaction among health and fitness centers two years in a row by JD Power and Associates. Visit jdpower.com for more. Click through for a free VIP pass. So much fucking jam from all these cranberries. So this is my phone. And now that it's Thursday, I can actually go to the general store and buy some more seeds. I need to buy some more cranberry seeds to fill out my plot inside the greenhouse. And I need to buy more wheat seeds so that I have enough to grow before, um, before uh, the season is over. Gotta get that milk. Gotta get that. Gotta get that. Gotta get that milk, milk, milk. Oh. It's going to be a long week, I can already feel it. I'm singing about gotta get that milk, of course it is. got that milk, 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 so it's okay. And, uh, I've also decided that, uh, when I get, when I do, uh, start playing those games for emulation, or Metroid specifically, I'm not gonna be using Spotify nearly as much, um, just because I like the soundtrack, uh, to... Metroid, is, uh, Metroid specifically is what made me think of that. I get, uh, get enough time, get enough done, maybe today, maybe this will be my last time streaming Stardew, um, and then I might switch over to Kerbal for a couple minutes, um, maybe for about an hour or so, and then we'll call out a stream after that. So if you're just turned, tuning in for that, you're seeing the ends of, uh, ends of my Stardew Valley stream. 
or you're gonna see the end of my Stardew Valley stream once I start getting all this sorted out. I have a couple more things to do today, so I'll be able to see that if nothing else. Get my preserve shed set up. My preserves shack. And let's get that up there and start brewing. So, I needed 64 and I only had 40, so I need four, or 24 more cranberries and, um, let's do the math. Actually, let's just take this out, I don't want this here anymore. Uh, 40 more wheat. One, two, three, four, five. Yep, 40 more wheat. So I'm gonna go put my stuff away. Sell my stuff. I need to sell. Oh, honey. Uh, let's sell that corn, that jelly, corn, cheese. Let's sell, or actually not sell, but... Put my wood away, put my, my minerals away, and oh, that was the right one. That goes in there, sort that. What's up? I have officially joined the party. Hey Aaron, how are you? You get to see me, uh, see me stream for a little bit in uh, Stardew Valley before we hop over to Kerbal Space Program. You guys have any uh, have any game suggestions? Just leave them in the leave them in the chat. I already have a list going. Um, move, lady. Thank you. Uh, so forty wheat, forty wheat, and so twenty four cranberries. Cranberries. Hope you guys are having a good time. I certainly am. It's a certain, certainly a break from the schoolwork that's pressing down on me currently. That's good. It's a. Uh, it's always a uh, always a good thing to just have people come around to hang. I, I do love the company. <laughs> <laughs> kind of why I wanted to do this. <laughs> you know what I mean. Chicken, I'm gonna need you to move. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Could you move, Zito? Zito, please. You don't, I need to get here, thank you. All right, those are all planted. Let's go put the mead in our brewing shed. Everything else in our uh, preserve shed. Actually, let's check check this completion of this first. Yeah, figured that'd be done. Give me that cheese. Nope. time thankfully hopefully the cranberries still grow in the winter time I'm pretty sure they will if not 
I goofed. But I have to imagine that's the way it works. Like I said, this is only my second playthrough. And this is the furthest I've got in this game. Alright. Cranberry seeds. You shall be planted! And I got some peach and pomegranate seeds up there. Scarecrows, keeping keeping an eye on my on my crops. Yeah, let's get some mayonnaise, cloth, mayonnaise, cheese, goat cheese, cheese, and spice berry. And coffee too, I'm not gonna use that. And then play in there. Okay. Let's go to sleep, see how much money we made, kiss our wife, because why not? Kiss. Um, well, uh, you get to, you get to watch me instead, right? Right, Belmo? Isn't that, isn't that better too? <laughs> um, so we got, we made about 10k that day. Not great. We've made upwards of 20 before. Um, but that's okay. We're just gonna say, okay, it's gonna save it. And then we're gonna, we're gonna switch over to Kerbal. <laughs> So, uh, let me get to see my face real big ah! while I, uh, I get this set up. Okay, Kerbal Space Program. on this monitor and what a face yes what a what a bearded bearded pasty face it is All right, let's see There we go. Just loading into Kerbal. <laughs> 